Hello everyone and welcome to episode 31 of the TCC CT Ceiling Vlog. Over the past couple weeks I've received some questions uh, regarding training and so I thought I'd dedicate this episode to CT Ceiling Training. Um, there are really kind of three training approaches that, that are being taken on, the, on, on training people in the system. One is uh, instructor-led training and in this case we're hitting um, the bulk of staff that, that work um, work very closely with the legacy environment and, and will be working very closely in the PeopleSoft environment, various aspects of their job. Um, so we want to make sure that, that all of those functional people um, or subject matter experts on campus get the appropriate training that they need. But then, but then there'll also be a train the trainer element. So as, the, as staff are going through training, CTC Link instructor-led training, um, they're learning how to use the system, but then they'll be teaching other uh, staff on campus uh, what they have learned about the system. Uh, because the, the CTC Link training team, unfortunately, they don't have enough training, trainers to be able to offer um, you know, multiple sections uh, of training on the campuses because they also have to train in Spokane as well. And so, so this train the trainer approach will help alleviate some of that to make sure that, that everybody gets the training that they need. Uh, in addition to that, there'll be self-paced uh, online training and that'll be around areas like um, instructor self-service or faculty self-service, uh, student self-service, uh, employee self-service and then uh, and, and some manager uh, training as well and so that'll be done online and that training isn't um, ready to, to be deployed at this point but there but I will show you a website where you will be able to find that training when it's available but also you'll be able to see some uh, quick reference guides and PowerPoints uh, for some of the trainings that are happening uh, right now and so uh, the site you'll want to go to is uh, HTTPS training.ctclink.sbctc.edu and you'll see here on this page um, this is kind of the, the home page of the site uh, it talks about technical requirements um, it has a glossary of terms for people soft speak uh, and some and how to use the U UPK or uh, user productivity kit um, and then a way you can contact the CTC link team if you have questions and then over on the left hand side you'll see um, Again, the technical requirements, how to use UPK, but then you'll see uh, the fundamentals, so the, uh, the UPKs that cover the fundamentals of PeopleSoft, how to navigate those kinds of things for the campus solutions pillar, for the uh, HCM pillar, and the finance pillar. And then you'll see training for all employees, training for all managers, and then specific training materials um, or training materials for employees, managers, and then materials for H, uh, HCM, campus solutions, finance, and then technical. So we'll kind of go through this a little bit. So under all employees, you'll see that um, there's various uh, training pieces, uh, topics here, creating a purchase requisition. There's a UPK, so you could watch video on how this is done. Or there's quick reference guides, so you can see various documents on how that process works. So when I click on uh, quick reference guides, and you'll see there's four different documents that you can access. So that's kind of the structure um, of these different areas. So under all managers, you'll see there's the manage self, manager self-service. So if we go into the uh, quick reference guides, um, you'll see uh, one of the quick reference guides for that. Uh, and then the UPK, I'll give you an idea of what that looks like. Uh, some of you may have already seen this, uh, but this is an, act an Oracle tool. Um, and then you can actually expand on the left-hand side here and go through various topics uh, and view different aspects of the system with the UPK. And then human capital management, you'll see various, uh, various documents and things related to that. Uh, anything that's that's highlighted in red, those are items that you can click on. The things in black are things that they haven't developed yet and made available. Um, so anyway, this site, I would, I would highly recommend visiting this site often because they add materials uh, all the time. Um, and I'll definitely be sending out specific links to the self-service uh, training sessions as they become available uh, so that we can, uh, so everybody can kind of learn the basics of the system, how to do some of those uh, basic pieces. Um, but, the, but like I said before, the, the bulk of the training is really focused on those, those key folks um, that, that intensively use the system uh, so that they then can in turn kind of train and show others how to use the system as well. So that's all I have for today, um, so I'll see you next time.